Hey, my little Einsteins. So today we're going to talk, we're going to continue talking about adaptation and surviving. Now there are some things that organisms can do that can help them adapt and survive. So for example, we have camouflage and mimicry. So let's do the first one. Camouflage, which everyone knows. Camouflage is where you can disguise the organism to anything. So it's like when you disguise a color, like an organism to the color of the background or or anything like that, or plants and animals. So if you take a look at this one, this picture, find the organism. What is being camouflaged? So if you take a look, there's that frog. It's right there. It camouflages with the pond water. It's the same color. So it's hiding in place. So it's hiding in this pond because it's both the same color. Now, why do they do this? Why do they camouflage? It's either to hunt. So for example, this lion, it is camouflaging with the tall grass so it can hunt for its prey. It's trying to look for the next victim or animal he can eat. So he hides in this tall brown grass and he blends in with his fur and all his hair, he blends in with it. So to camouflage is to disguise where you're not able to see it. Now we also, it's either to hunt or to hide. So we have these animals, they hide in, cam in the other things or other living things where they can hide from its predators. So for example, this grasshopper, it's camouflaging with the plant around it. Why? Because they have the same color. They do this so the predators won't come and eat him. Poor grasshopper. Just, just like that. So like we talked about earlier, you remember the tree frog? You see how it camouflages with the tree? That's why it's called a tree frog. <laughs> it camouflages with that plant, with that tree, to hide from its predators. So for example, when you put like something black on top of black or white on top of white, you won't be able to see it because it's camouflaged. That's what it is. They do this to either hide or to hunt. Mm -hmm. Now, what is mimicry? Mimicry is to copy another organism. It's basically a copycat. It's when one organism copycats another organism. Now, they do this to also hunt and to hide. So for example, if you take a look, this is a butterfly. This butterfly, its wings has the same print as either an owl because of the big black dot or a snake because of that small black dot. It mimics another organism, why? To hide away from the other predators. It's pretending to be an owl or it pretends to be a snake to hide from other predators. So that's really cool. We also have this animal. This animal, he stands very still for a very long time. Why? To pretend that he is part of the plant. He's part of that tree. So he stands there for a really long time and he doesn't move to the point where it looks like he's part of the plant. So I want to show you an example. And this is what I mean. Where's the organism? Where is the organism? If you said the one that looks like a head on the side and here's the arm, that is the organism. That is a lizard that is the same color as the leaf. And he stands there for a very, very, very long time to the point where predators think, Carlos, he's part of the leaf. He's part of the plant. I don't know who this is, but Carlos, I don't want it anymore. And that's what it is. So he camouflages and he mimics. He mimics a plant to the point where he just stands there and he does not move. So that's mimicry. It's when we copycat. Oh, it's when it copycats. Or for example, when we play Simon Says, when we, or not Simon Says, when we cop, we mimic each other. So when we were like, oh, hello, hello, hi, hi. That's mimicry. When we're like, stop copying us. That's what it is. Now, why else do they do this? They do this because, for example, these butterflies, the monarchy, okay, the mar uh, monarch, it t it's a butterfly that no organism, no animal can eat it because it's very, very poisonous. It will kill him. While the vicary, it's 
it has a very sweet taste or it's a it's a butterfly that other predators would eat it so the vicary would copy would mimic the monarchy to the same pattern the same how it flies how it where does it move and all of this where it copies it so the other organism other animals and predators won't eat him because he doesn't want he doesn't want to die he's like no nah, no nah, man if he tastes like poison if he's poisonous then i want to pretend to be like him and copy him so where other predators won't eat me either i don't want him to eat me no 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 he, i'm poisonous just like him so he's gonna try to hide from him they do this now also there is different kind of animals where they can mimic other animals as well so for example there's also a snake that has the same pattern as an octopus like a, a different kind of octopus where if the the snake he stretches out his arms he looks like an octopus so no one will eat that there's also where we said a wasp that remember a, a wasp that has a, a little it's like a bee okay and a moth that they have very similar colors so if the bee the moth pretends to be like the wasp so no one will eat them so animals they mimic other animals why to hide from predators and try to survive that's what it is i hope you enjoyed this lesson if you have any questions please email your teacher thank you